A research team led by Professor Isamu Shina of the Department of Applied Chemistry at Tokyo University of Science has succeeded in using a new catalytic reaction to synthesize non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs with double the previous levels of purity. Non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, or NSAIDs, are widely used as analgesics to treat colds, headaches, muscle pain, and eye conditions. Well-known brands include ibuprofen and loxaprofen. A problem in the synthesis of NSAIDs is the presence of mirror image isomers, or enantiomers. Enantiomers are like one's left and right hands. They're mirror images of each other. Of these two mirror image isomers, only the S-type is medically active. The R-type may be either inactive or cause unwanted side effects. Standard methods of synthesis can only produce a mixture of equal amounts of S and R types, which is called a racemate. Methods have been tried for synthesizing only the S type or extracting the S type from the racemate, but with little success. The new method developed by Professor Sheena's team solves this problem. ま、This is a schematic diagram of the reaction process. The racemate and an alcohol are placed in a vessel to which is added the catalyst and a coupling agent. The S-type isomers couple with the alcohol, reducing the quantity of S-type. Next, the action of the coupling agent causes conversion of R-type to S-type. As the catalyst continues to couple S-type with the alcohol, the quantity of S-type continues to fall. Eventually, this reaction leaves only S-type ester. Finally, the resulting ester is transformed into the corresponding S-type NSAID. In the previous methods, half the R-type remains at the end of the reaction, meaning only half the raw material can be used. With the new method, virtually all the raw material can be used. The key is the selection of catalyst and an anhydride coupling agent. <laughs> This principle can be used with many structurally similar compounds to extract only S-type. 今までのこのヒステロイド性の抗炎症薬は半分は不純物を含んだ薬剤をま使用せざるを得なかったという状態だったんですけども、我々の今回の方法によって完全に一方に寄せられる実際にそれを利用される患者さんも効果の高いその一
治療ができるんじゃないかなというふうに考えております。The team's thesis featured as the inside cover article in the UK journal Catalysis Science and Technology and was selected as a hot article. The article can be read online. Since the new method is twice as efficient at synthesizing NSAIDs, it brings considerable cost savings. And elimination of the R type component removes possible side effects. This method is expected to revolutionize drug synthesis. The Tokyo University of Science has applied for patents for these research results and is already entering into non exclusive licensing contracts. If your company is interested in a non exclusive licensing contract, please contact the Tokyo University of Science TLO at the URL shown.